Now, going to the next thing, Kai Havertz got announced throughout all of this stuff. As everything else is going on, welcome Kai Havertz to Arsenal as he was fully announced by Arsenal at this moment in time. This was this this was expected. Everyone was expecting Kai Havertz to be announced, but he was announced in the middle of all this stuff happening, in the middle of all the transfer news around Timber and Declan Rice. This news came out. Kai Havertz, welcome to Arsenal, Kai Havertz. This was about four hours ago. Arsenal officially tweeted it out. And you know what? He's now an Arsenal player. I'm going to back him. Arsenal fans, I hope you guys back him also, as he is going to be one of us. And we back our players. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter where they came from. Once they're a gooner and they're wearing that kit, I'm going to back them. If they have poor games, I'm going to criticize them. If they have good games, I'm going to uh, big them up. But from the moment they wear that kit, from the moment they wear that kit, one second. From the moment a player puts on the kit and they go like this, the moment they do this and they take a photo, you know what we do? We back those guys. It's not about it's not about what's on the back of the shirt, guys. What's on the back of the shirt never matters. It's always about what's on the front of the shirt, ladies and gentlemen, and and that's what that's what we do. We support the we support the badge. We don't support who's on the back. At the end of the day, what's on the back doesn't matter. It's about who's wearing the kit. If they're if they're an Arsenal player, we back them. And yeah, man, Eid Mubarak, everyone. Hopefully, you guys are having a great day. Congratulations on Declan Rice. Big up to you, Yasin. Big up to you. Big up to everyone in the comment section. Big up to everyone in the comment section. Let me just continue going through everything. And I swear, I promise, I'll try to go back and I'll try to make sure I read as many of your comments as possible. But let's continue as there is still a lot to get through. Um, then after the Kai Havertz news, there, of course, Arsenal dropped a video of Kai Havertz. Kai Havertz wearing the 29 shirt. And Kai Havertz is a gunner. It is it is strange to see Kai Havertz uh, as a gunner. Uh, he uh, he did play for Chelsea for the last couple of years. Sure. In the Declan Rice announcement, I'm also going to take this time to also say hello to Kai Havertz, as Kai Havertz has agreed a long term contract with Arsenal. He's officially joined the biggest club in London. Big up to Kai Havertz. Welcome Kai Havertz. You know what? Kai Havertz is a gooner. I was not really a big fan of the signing initially, but now that we get closer and closer and closer to uh, the season, I'm starting to get more and more excited about all these signings that we're making. So let's just look at what Arsenal had to say about the signing of the German international Kai Havertz. Kai Havertz joining us from Chelsea on a long-term contract. A 24-year-old for his uh, for his international side has had 34 appearances and scored 13 goals. Of course, at Bayer Leverkusen, where he was an academy graduate, was where he's seen the most of his uh, best time. But of course, Arsenal have signed Kai Havertz. It is official. Arsenal have signed Kai Havertz. And Mikel Arteta had this to say about Kai Havertz. Kai Havertz is a is a is a player with top qualities, great versatility, intelligent player, huge amount of extra strength in our midfield and and very. Uh, variety of our play so there you go right there he he most likely will be playing in the midfield that is what everyone was saying he also goes into his mentality and everything else Kai Havertz speaking about his family there's a full-out interview that he does with the Arsenal website and of course here is here's all the pictures and everything with Kai Havertz as you can see there's some things you know what this might be interesting what 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 are the 13 things that we need to know about Kai Havertz? Because I'm, I, I, I'm, we might learn some new things. Hometown hero, interesting. Kai Havertz seems to be a hometown hero. Interesting, I didn't know that. Unsung, uh, his idol. Who's that? His idol, okay, his idols are Zidane, Kaka, not Michael Owen, or Fernand, what? As well as former Liverpool striker, not Michael Owen, or Fernand Torres, but interesting. Interesting, interesting choice. That's his. That's his. That's one. Albeit, albeit is is one of his idols. Former Liverpool striker. Albeit, not Michael Owen or Ferran Torres. That's interesting. Uh, he made a he his debut at Leverkusen, of course, uh, and how he was called upon. Interesting. Uh, he's a record holder for what? What is he a record holder for? Uh, Leverkusen's first team player to break through a record. Uh, since was, uh, of course, overtaken by Florian Witzer. But, of course, that is another thing. He he first signed his, his contract, of course, as a youngster in 2017 with Leverkusen. Okay. Memorable Champions League moment, of course, with Chelsea. And then what else What else do we have? Of 
course, he's a big animal guy. He loves animals, as we know. He loves donkeys. He's spoken about that numerous times. Um, Kai Havertz talking about how various charities, okay? Um, what else? Oh, he does have a connection with uh, – Arsenal does have a connection with German players, so he does know Podolski and, of course – is Podolski or La no? We had Mustafi also, but yeah, that that is that. Honestly, we we feel for next season. No, that's not good enough. It's not Partey good enough. has Partey has to stay in some facet. But if but so if Partey, I Partey Partey rise and then if Timber comes in and then Kai moves up more attacking, sort of like what Stones does with City. So could, do you think? Do you think this could? I think this could definitely be our midfield against some teams, though. Especially yeah, for sure, yeah. The, look, for sure, you know, you want to attack more and stuff like that. But yeah, I see more of his, a, a declaration. Question: Do you guys do you guys care that Kai Havertz came from Chelsea because he had his goodbye to Chelsea? Did you see this, uh, dear Chelsea? I would have preferred uh, to uh, you to hear this. Uh, my thoughts on leaving Chelsea first from myself. My thoughts on joining my uh, my new club. This is. My style, it's upsetting me that you had to hear it on this way, but I'm writing to you with a heavy heart uh, to the fans. Big thanks for supporting me. We achieved the dream uh, together of the Champions League, Kai. And he just basically said goodbye. He didn't really say much. <laughs> he didn't really say much. He just said, he just said goodbye. Some people calling him snakes. Some people, some people making, some people laughing. But yeah, Kai Havertz a gooner. I really don't. I really don't give a shit that that he that he played for Chelsea. I'm kind of I'm I'm kind of happy that that we we could actually see if 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 Arteta can do stuff that none of those Chelsea managers could have done. But yeah, I'm I'm gonna be wrapping it up, people. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed the stream. Uh, Iga, why you read? Iga, the way you read is hilarious, man. Nico, man, come on. If you don't know by now, if you don't know right by now. I kind of struggle to read because I have a learning disability, but it's okay because it doesn't affect me in my real life. I still work fine. I do all my stuff in life perfectly fine. I still graduated from university. I still have a good job. Reading the the, the level or standard that I read at that didn't really affect me. I understand what I'm reading. It's just sometimes reading it and saying it out loud is the issue, but it is what it is. I, hopefully you guys understand what I'm saying and hopefully it doesn't affect the stream too much and you guys still enjoy the streams regardless. Thank you for watching Eagle Talks Football. Hopefully you enjoyed that clip. Now let me know what you guys thought about it in the comment section. Make sure you do hit that like button as we try to get past at least 100 likes on all the videos. And also, let me know. Did you watch the full video? Because the link is in the description. Have yourselves a wonderful day, guys. We're out of here.